done that from a young age, so you, you've had a problem, you've seen it, and then you've just gone, right, okay, what can we do about it? Mm -hmm. From your playground days, when you're like, you're, you're selling biscuits to yeah, yeah, yeah. all the issues that you're getting, um, which a lot of us will watch on YouTube, like, literally, it's like an event. Like, <laughs> we can't wait for it to come out, and we're sitting there, like, <laughs> watching, waiting for it to premiere, man. But it feels like you have these problems, and then you, instead of dwelling on it, you just overcome them and think of it as a, almost like a game, where, mm -hmm. okay, how do we take this to the new level and like, how do we get past it, yeah, which is yeah. amazing. Um, and just touching on that point, because it's something that we haven't discussed yet and I wanted to, um, your YouTube, where it has blown up like crazy. <laughs> oh my God, it's gone from, I saw your post the other day, it went from zero to 666, um, which obviously you're like, yo, someone subscribe, quick time, because yeah, it's not yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> in, the, in the space of what, like two months? Of Four now, I think. Has it been four months? That's crazy because it feels like you release a video like every other week. <laughs> yeah, um, sure. But to go from that to like in, in four months, that's that's quite impressive. Yeah, what, yeah. what sort of okay, first of all, when you started the channel, what made you want to start it? And then number two, what sort of direction <laughs> did you have for it and has that changed or have you just gone with what you wanted to start with? To answer the, uh, the first question, I think we wanted to. Be a channel that we wish we could have watched when we was first starting and so uh, i know we've mentioned it before but like a lot of people try to sell you the dream they don't tell you about what can go wrong and stuff yeah, so yeah. we wanted to just jump straight into it and then um listen i know a lot of newbies yeah they will just try and they'll find out someone on youtube or they'll see someone somewhere yeah. doing well and then they'll reach out to them on facebook yeah, and then yeah. we used to just do that yeah and then we'll just be like let me, let me call you, it'd be much easier. Okay, yeah, yeah. cool, right, right then. Hello. And then they start pitching you something or doing something. That. Yeah. So I'm just like, what is it, is it really worth that much money to find out yeah, yeah, yeah. an answer to a question? So why don't I just... So you guys wanted to go down the path of almost as like a video tutorial documentary because essentially yeah. what you guys are doing is you're teaching a lot of us. Um, so you're, I mean, some of your latest videos are like, has Shepherd demand in an area? You're talking about like sort of like tenanting HMOs and the problems that you have. But what you do, which is different from everyone else, is you actually video record yourself. Um, yeah. Some of the clips are just hilarious in this own. But anyone that hasn't watched this, they're just they they're gold. But it's because you don't change the way that you are. Yeah. You dress the same. You talk the same. You just are yourselves um, yeah, yeah. online. But I've noticed that a lot of people that are tuned into your channel, they tend to learn a fair bit from like what you're actually like sort of like the videos that you're putting out there. Mm. What sort of direction do you want to take it moving forward? So I know obviously it's like, you've built a good foundation and a lot of people are learning from you. Do you still want to have that as the case or do you want to yeah. sort of like move to other projects or? So like for example, our next video is like, we're, we're going to be taking on a deal or we might be taking on a deal we haven't made an offer yet. So mm. what we're going to do the video about is everything we do to check the due diligence. So um, title deeds, planning permission, um, check the license, Mm. Um, check the demand, walk the streets, walk the streets in the area, area, speak to the people hands. in the area. We're going to yeah. show everything exactly how we check the title deeds, what, title deeds, what we need to check in them. Like, like, that you no one even thinks about that, you know. Yeah, <laughs> like, you, you will literally watch that video and know exactly what to do once it's out. But that's what we want to do. Like, we, just, we, 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 we haven't got an agenda, we're not trying to eventually yeah. do training or do yeah. mentoring or anything. Yeah. That's not something that we, we want to do, we just want to show or share sorry our experiences and see yeah, I'm, 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 a, for us. I'm a massive believer which is why you guys are such a big part of like our property newbie community which is just give people value and like, focus on your business as a separate entity you don't yeah. need to entwine the two yeah. so like if you end up doing something in, in property and you learn something you don't need to put a price tag on sharing it mm, and you yeah, guys have yeah. shown that you don't just have to do that on a platform such as Facebook or Insta You've actually gone online and done it on something like YouTube, which is, is scary, man, because you're putting yourself yeah. out there to be exposed mm -hmm. um, to, to the whole world, man. So, fair play to you in, in that respect. Appreciate it, mate. Thank you. Yeah. Right. For anyone that wants to do like YouTube as well, and you're probably just thinking, like, oh, what's people going to think about me? Yeah, yeah. that's exactly what people are going to be commenting on my hair, hair <laughs> <laughs> No, but the, the first thing, right? You see, see the, the, the first video I ever made, yeah? I was just like, we need to have a YouTube channel. Bill wasn't really on it at the time. Yeah, yeah. I thought I was like, oh, so I start, you know, the very first video, I'm just messing up. Like, you can watch it if you want to watch our very first video on our channel. Yeah, yeah. The first 10 seconds of me going, 
What's up, YouTube? Uh, like, I don't know what to say. <laughs> you, you said something to me which kind of struck me, um, is that when you started your YouTube channel, you wanted to come across a certain way, and then within about 30 seconds you ditched it and said, you know what, I just yeah. want to be myself. Yeah. And as soon as he was like, oh what, you're just going to be yourself? Like, <laughs> yeah. you're just gonna be that. He's like, yeah, I'll be in it, man. Yeah. <laughs> and what, what I also thought as well is, like, all of, all of the benefits that it will help, like, all, all the benefits it will give us, like, how it will help us, so why wouldn't I do it? What, am I worried about what someone else thinks of me? Like, why wouldn't I do it if it's going to help me? It takes a brave person, and this is something that we were talking about earlier, in the fact that we live in a generation now which can sit behind a keyboard, um, say their opinions and views, ensure that you read them. <laughs> and it takes a mentally strong person to be like, well, I know everyone says all these things, right? Well, oh, you've got haters now, that's amazing. Oh, you've got, you got, yeah, you got. Yeah. but in all honesty, that means nothing. Um, yeah. Because the, the, the comments that people leave are still gonna affect you and they're still gonna be hurtful. But for you guys, how do you handle that? Because oh. property is one of those things now, it's, it's coming under the microscope, isn't it? I think at first, I can deal with it very well because yeah. I'm from a background where if someone mugs you off, you yeah. ring them or meet them, right? Mm -hmm. And then you settle it, right? <laughs> like, however that would be done, yeah? Um, like just a chat or, or anything else in this case. But if, if like you, um, if I'm just online now, it's a new thing for me. I'd never been online six months ago. I had, didn't have Insta, yeah. didn't have YouTube, didn't have nothing. Like, um, even two years ago, I used to have a £10 plan. Like, yeah, that's yeah, just yeah, what yeah. I used to have. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, but so I've never really experienced someone being just completely lying about me, and, and I can't do anything <laughs> about it. Yeah, yeah. I just have to sit there and be like, oh, alright, well, I just got to deal with that. <laughs> but it's like, now it's just like, um, basically, from speaking to you, mate, like, you sort of told me, just like, yeah. it's like, it's just like that's if you're going to grow in business it's going to come so you have to yeah. learn to deal with it like and I, think, I think the biggest example is one of your idols is grant cardone oh, how so. much hate does but he get on a day and he loves it he looks at it, 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 it he thrives off it do you know yeah. what i mean but uh, the reason i say all of this is because i made some crazy mistakes when i was starting out and what's endearing about you boys is you you've only really jumped on social media recently you know yeah. uh, guys that have had facebook since it started or like we, we have facebook yeah. Years back, there was just messaging family that's in France. Yeah, and, yeah. Do you know what I mean? So yeah, it's never been like I'm not doing that post or do yeah. you know what I mean? You know? And then to transition it to to come across and create almost a personal brand where yeah. like, you're just being yourselves and then you're trying to relate that to property as well and building the two together from a, a platform that you've barely used before. Yeah. You, mm -hmm. you're you're killing it. Like you post daily, it gets a lot of engagement. You've got a lot of followers now, even on YouTube as well. Your channel is growing. Mm -hmm. Engagement's insane, yeah, yeah. But it takes a lot of bravery to put yourself out there in the first place, yeah, definitely. Just goes back to like if it's going to help you, do it, yeah, and just don't care what others think of you, yeah, yeah, yeah. So, yeah, yeah. And like I said, your main objective is to not only document your journey but then also to help other people as well, which brings me nicely onto a little something that I want to like sort of share myself.